If you have any information pertaining to this case, you may contact the Maryland Office of the Chief Medical Examiner by telephone at 410-333-3250 or by email at info at ocmemd.org. On the 6th of December 1973, the body of a young man was located in a wooded area on Old Crane Highway near Pennsylvania Avenue in Upper Marlboro, Prince George's County, Maryland. A post-mortem examination revealed that he'd been dead mere hours. According to a web sleuth user by the name of Astrid XX, they spoke to the medical examiner in 2012, who said that the male's cause of death was pneumonia. He was of Caucasian descent and most likely between 15 and 20 years old. He was small in stature at about 5 feet tall and 105 pounds. He had brown hair, brown eyes and a faint moustache. He was found wearing a blue or grey cotton jacket with a collar that bore the initials ELT, a green sweatshirt, white undershorts, a brown belt, grey and white corduroy trousers with multiple crude scribblings on them, one of these scribblings being the word Shalom, a pair of socks and a pair of brown boots. There is a post-mortem image available which is quite graphic but I'm showing it for identification purposes only. If you are sensitive to or disturbed by seeing images of a deceased person, I would advise you to look away now. The post-mortem image has now been replaced. It is thought likely that the decedent may have been hospitalised in the days prior to his death, though I'm uncertain how this conclusion was reached. Web sleuth user Astrid XX was apparently told by the medical examiner that the unidentified male had track marks in his arms, which suggests that he may have been a drug abuser. A theory also brought up on web sleuths is that the unidentified male may have escaped from a nearby juvenile detention centre by the name of Boys Village. Boys Village, or Cheltenham Youth Facility as it's known these days, is a detention centre for boys under 18 years old, who reside there whilst awaiting court appearances for their crimes. Although, again according to Absolute's user Astrid XX, the individual who was head of Boys Village in the 1970s has stated that they don't remember one of their boys running away and never being found. There is a possibility that perhaps the unidentified male was Jewish, as he had the Hebrew word Shalom written on his pants which is an expression meaning peace that is commonly used by Jews. Though, as always, neither of these theories have ever been confirmed. It's also entirely possible that he wasn't Jewish, nor was he a runaway. Whatever the circumstances, it's been 46 years since this young boy's body was located, and he remains unidentified. As of December 2019, Namus doesn't list any rule outs, though if any are added in the future, I shall list them in the description of this video. Again, if you have any information that may aid in the identification of this decedent, you are urged to call the Maryland Office of the Chief Medical Examiner by telephone at 410-333-3250 or by email at info at ocmend.org. Thank you very much for giving the case of the Prince George's County John Doe a moment of your day.